everyone. It's so good to see you again. I'm Sharla, for those of you that I haven't met, here to talk to women of a certain age about dressing from the inside out on the right side of 50. Today we are talking about blouses, and I'm going to show you a few different ways that you can wear blouses for different occasions. I do love a blouse because a lot of times, I sometimes when I'm grabbing in my closet and we have the tank tops, we have the t-shirts, a blouse just elevates whatever you're wearing just a little bit. And you know me, I like to elevate things a little. So let's start off with this great little blouse from Alice and Joy. It's got a fun little floral pattern to it, little snap front. Um, I kept mine snapped all the way up. Um, if you want to, some people might, you know, you can un undo a couple snaps if that's what you like, depending upon where you want it to fall on your decollete. This has a nice little um, strap, so it's bra friendly, which I always love. And then I paired mine for a day of running around um, with these great Parker Agoldy shorts. Let me talk about the Parker Agoldies a little bit. They come in a few different, two different lengths. There's the Parker and then there's the Parker Long. I love the Parker Long. It's not a Bermuda, but it's just a little bit longer than the typical Parker short. Still has the same fun distressing on it and the pockets and all that. Sometimes at my age, I feel like the cutoff shorts, I don't want to it to look like daisy dookie on me so i like it just a little bit extra length which this parker long gives you but again it's not a bermuda length so if you want that little in between this is the way to go i did the level 99 utility shacket on the top um, we talked about shackets before it's a shirt plus a jacket a shacket right so um, you can wear it all snapped up if you do want to wear it more like a shirt or unsnap it and I always roll the sleeves a little for it's a it's a kind of a linen fabrication so it's something that you can use now in those cooler summer nights so during the day when it's 90 plus you've got your thin little blouse on that really keeps you cool and then as the sun goes down you can just throw this on the top and then of course these fun little Vince Camuto's um, little strappy uh, sandals um, with a little just a little of the accent of the silver on there and of course with silver then I lean towards the silver jewelry stacking my little bracelets as I always do and then this fun little necklace which I love it's, it has a little tiny pendant on it and it says mama which I I think it's so great my kids call me mama so anyways that is the first look for blouses I'll be right back with look number two okay we're back with look number two with blouses and this time last time we were running some errands this time we're going back to work because I know a lot of you are heading back into the office and wanting to update your wardrobe so that you're on trend with that this again is a little Alice and Joy um, it's a little bit of a v-neck to it I love the sleeve on this I really do it's it's blouses right here and it has a little bit of a gathered right here again it hides this piece of your arm if it's not your favorite piece and then um i just love how it just drapes down now sometimes when i'm doing a lot of tops i'll do like the front tuck to me that's a little bit more casual look so for work i'm just going to leave it um just straight down and kind of shows off your curve a little bit but it's not body clinging Okay, I paired it with these great Spanx pants. Um, they have a fun little cargo pocket on the side. There's a lot of questions sometimes when people are doing Spanx because of course we know that Spanx started as shapewear, right? Then, they, then we moved into like Spanx pants. I love a Spanx pant, but a lot of times people ask, I don't know what size to get. Do I get the same size that I do when I'm wearing them as shapewear? Do I go up? What are all the things? So I don't like fighting my pants <laughs> when I get on in the morning. I like to just have them a nice easy on. So I actually size up. I'm typically a 26, 27 in denim, and I do a medium in the Spanx pants. They're just easy for me to get on. They do warm up to your body, but they're not going to stretch out like maybe a denim would. So what you see is what you get when you try them on. So if you try them on and they feel great, that's what you're taking home. I'm going to give you permission, show off your curves, okay? The Spanx is going to kind of hold you in in the right places, so it's really going to accentuate the parts that you love about your body, and it's going to hold in the parts that maybe aren't your favorites. And then I paired it with these fun little Vince Camuto slides, which I've shown you guys before, but they are really a, a favorite of mine. And again, they have that little gold um, detailing there, so I stayed with a heavier gold bracelet. And then this fun necklace, I want you to notice the detail on this, see how there's a little bit of a chain that kind of mimics the chain in the shoe and then there's also like a little the, it, it goes half and half and then it goes into this little thicker um, gold um, on the side so that's kind of a fun something different to do and because of the weight because I did a heavier bracelet have a heavier chain on the shoe and a heavier necklace I skipped the earrings for work I just thought that this was enough to balance out your outfit and 
you're ready to go to work. Okay, so that was look number two with blouses. I'll be right back with look number three. Last but not least, I have a habit of saving my favorite outfit for the last, and I don't know why I do that, but this one is my favorite look. This is a little blouse by Ronan Ryan. That's one of our house brands. I wanna remind you, all the blouses that I showed you today are all our house brands, so you'll only find them at Ever Eve. So this little Ronan Ryan blouse, which I love. You know why? Here's what I'm gonna tell you why. Look at this fun little flutter sleeve. Absolutely obsessed with this flutter sleeve. Also, this blouse has almost like a little bit of a swing to it. Um, I'm wearing an extra small right now, and I'm just gonna leave it out, so it's almost like has a little bit of movement to it. So as I'm talking and moving for date night, um, it moves right along with me. So date night jean, don't let anyone tell you that skinnies are out because girl, we love a good skinny. They work so great to kind of sh accentuate the um, smallest part of your, for, of my leg anyway, which is my ankle. So I love that it gives me a little curve all the way down. And going into fall, you're also going to love a skinny jean to go inside your boots. So keep that in mind. These are the Aubrey by Seven for All, for All Mankind. There's a little bit of a distressing on the knee, which keeps it really current and fun. And then Gosh, Mark Fisher sandals, like these scream date night. Look at how cute and braided they are with a little block heel. And then of course, I have to add jewelry. Um, so remember the little necklace I showed you in outfit one that was silver? This is the gold version of it. And this little bracket says positivity, which I love. These again, these earrings, are you kidding me? Scream date night. And then this fun little chain bracelet. Look how cute, it has a little bit of a little star pendant on there, which is so great and so fun. So that's your look for date night with blouses. Hopefully I gave you a little insight on all the blouse things. Get some in your closet. I know you're gonna love them. Come on into our store. Let our girls collaborate with you and find just the right one for you and your lifestyle. See you next time.